and welcome back to another video of Marvel Contest of Champions. Today I'm going to be showing you a second option, like a second lot of team that you can take for this Odin side quest. Um, tier 6, for those of you that didn't have the champs that I posted in the first video. So, you have a magic, if you have a magic, magic can easily take out the first fight. Now the main thing to remember in this fight was the death touch and that happens when she fires a SP1 a little grey icon will appear underneath her health bar and while that is active make sure she does not hit you does not hit into your block, nothing you will be killed instantly Other than that, quite a straightforward fight And there we have it, our next fight is Korg. Now in the first video I showed how you can easily take him down with Omega Red. Today we will be using Colossus and I will show you that you can take him down almost just as easy. It may not be as fast but it's still very doable. For those of you that have Colossus, it can be another easy time. Just remember that when you're fighting a Korg, do not use heavies or you will get damage reflected back onto you from his rock shields just do tap 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 build uh, get rid of his rock shields and then you can fight him as normal then just go crazy on him now i did try to evade his sp1 Usually I have a success rate of probably about 90 to 95%. On that occasion he caught me, but as you can see, when it happens again, I easily evade it. Now the best way that I improved my gameplay over time with continuous practicing was if there was a champion that I could not defeat, I would go into the search bar and then I would duel him. I would pick a very weak character, so let's say for argument's sake, I would then pick a two star Colossus and then I would search for a four to five star Korg and then I would basically keep dueling him until I perfected the fight. And there we have it. Colossus easily can defeat a Korg. So on to the third fight, which is Hulk Ragnarok. Now, he has a regeneration, but to be honest, it's not anything too crazy on the tier six. So I wanted to show a different character to use. So I chose the Sentinel. Um, he does have a heal block on his SP1 if you did want to use it, but in all fairness, once I built him up, then he easily destroyed him. And there we have it. The Sentinel can easily defeat Hulk Ragnarok. Onto the next fight, which was Loki. And for Loki, I decided to use Hyperion, just to show some variety of characters that you can use in this tier six chapter. And uh, yeah, he done really good.
And that was it. He actually destroyed him. Very quick fight. Fantastic uh, option to use there. And on to the last fight, which is Th uh, Thor Ragnarok. And for this fight, I decided to use Venom. Once again, very straightforward fight. And once you're familiar of fighting Thor Ragnarok, you obviously just watch out for his um, charges that he builds up. Make sure you fire that SP1 or an SP2 before he gets to 19. And you're good to go. And there you have it, another nice easy quick fight. For those of you that don't have any of the other champions for the boss, you can easily use Venom as well. Well, please give a like and subscribe guys, it really helps the channel out and I'll see you in the next one.